Hospitals just for children exist because lots of kids are sick. It's that simple. And of those kids, over half of them are there because of a genetic disease. These children are facing incurable immune disorders, such as multiple sclerosis or type 1 diabetes, and hundreds of other diseases like sickle cell anemia. At Seattle Children's, this is not something we just accept. We view each day as one step closer to a cure. In the past, we'd treat a child with a genetic disease who was, say, born with no immunity, by putting him in a bubble. Later, we started performing stem cell transplants, and that was a lot better. But today, our researchers have taken a groundbreaking leap into gene editing, and it's nothing short of miraculous. Gene editing is all about precision. We start by studying the more than 3 billion DNA sequences in a person's genome to isolate the one gene that's causing a disease. Then we either reprogram that gene or turn it off completely. Say a child has a genetic blood disease, like sickle cell or hemophilia. We would draw some of his stem cells and remove the faulty gene causing the disease using a gene editing tool developed at Seattle Children's. Then we'd rewrite his genetic code and return the corrected stem cells to his body, curing him of the disease. Kind of like erasing an error in a blueprint of a house and redrawing it correctly. Gene editing will also improve the effectiveness of today's immunotherapy treatments, allowing them to be applied to diseases beyond cancer, like lupus, arthritis, and HIV, and also conditions like organ rejection after a transplant. In a child with an immune disorder, like type 1 diabetes, the specialists at Seattle Children's would use gene editing to develop a cell that turns off the disease. Our first step would be to remove some of the child's own disease-causing T cells, then reprogram them and put them back into her body. They'd go right to work as peacekeepers that target damaging cells, shutting them down until her diabetes is completely gone. By isolating a precise portion of DNA, the potential of gene editing is extraordinary. It'll mean reducing the need for treatments like chemotherapy and eliminating bone marrow transplants, which can have serious side effects. Most importantly, it will cure even the rarest of diseases. Support Seattle Children's Research Institute, the world's leader in pediatric gene editing. With your help, we can move even faster and turn a devastating diagnosis into a lifetime of good health.